What's up, what's up, what's up? The ECW original, or actually, correction, the original ECW original, Bay Ragney. I'm in the house, Mr. Chubby Dudley. What's going on, everybody? Thanks for tuning in for another episode. I hope you're enjoying these uh, as much as I am, taking a little walk down memory lane. Uh, we are working on episode three of ECW television um, from the very beginning, season one, episode three, April 20th, 1993, and we have match number two, and I don't know who it is. I'm going to hit play. We're going to find out together. Uh, I know I see Mr. Jimmy Snooker there. Let me uh, make myself a little smaller, make that a little bigger. How am I going to do this here? There we go, and let me hit play and let's get on with the show oh. make sure my screen is, okay there it is all right let's go let's do it this is the first of two semi-final matches for the ecw television title it is slated for one fall the good thing is i don't remember who won the title so i'm um... mystic isle new jersey he weighs 245 pounds Iron Man, Tommy Cairo. Tommy Cairo. First, I would like to introduce the advisor. He represents Hot Stuff International. Hot Stuff, Eddie Gilbert. I was wondering what he was doing. I'm like, why is he with the cowboy hat looking drunk? Now I, okay. Well, we're back, fans. That incredible mayhem there before the break. I'm you know, it, it's Eddie Gilbert. It's kind of hard to believe. Like, it just hit me. And it's kind of hard to believe, like, Jimmy and Eddie. I mean, come on, let's face it. Two uh, wrestling legends, especially Jimmy. Um, Eddie was really taken away from us very young. But two legends no longer with us. Shame. Really sad. Sucker and Terry Funk here ringside. But we're here for a big, important semifinal match. For the ECW TV title tournament, we've got the number one seed, Superfly Jimmy Snuka, facing off, the, off against the undefeated number four. So this was basically 30 years ago, but it's, it's um, you got the former, so scary, former 30 freaking years. Unbeaten Tommy Cairo until this match, because to go up against the, the likes of Jimmy Superfly Snuka with the advisor of Hot Stuff Eddie Gilbert, it's a tough road. <sighs> There's Stan the Fan right there. Funk's back. I just had my head right off by Eddie Gilbert. He's the greatest wrestler I've ever seen. Dave Let me see Gilbert. if I can try to make it bigger for you. There we go. He's the best of everything. I'm Terry Funk. I'm a living legend. I'm the king of the Texas death legend. I'm the new Hulk. I'm the new Hulk. You're Eddie Gilbert, and you disgust me is what you do. I've never seen a more disgust. Despicable act of my whole life, Eddie Gilbert. You can get out of here. That was the best Terry Funk impression I've ever heard in my life. I thought it was him. What a despicable human being. I can't believe that the likes of Jimmy Superfly Snooker would align himself with an animal like Eddie Gilbert. Back in the ring, we got Snooker against Tyro. Should be one heck of a match, Stevie. It already is. Really that was like, I hate to say it, but a lazy Tyro, bump on Jimmy Jimmy's Snooker. part. Both these guys are ripped, ready for action. Tommy Cairo cranking down on that side headlock. They both know if they win this match, they are one match away from the gold. The one only, match. Yeah, one match away from the gold. And the only thing I know, and looking at the brackets, I still see Jimmy Superfly Snooker. I still see Eddie Gilbert in the lineup. What That's would happen right. if uh, those two end up meeting in the final? Well, Eddie's asked me if he's pulled his hair, but I got to be honest, uh, Hello, I don't know. Sorry, folks, back. Somebody's Get this despicable this human being out of here, Stevie. Yes, it's Terry Funk's coffee, Eddie Gilbert. That's whose coffee it is. Man, the third voice you hear in the booth is uh, Terry Funk joining us. That's not Terry Funk. You know that's not Terry Funk. Tommy Cairo still you know, with that side head looking on the Superfly. Watch the hair, though, referee. Oh, you Ref know he's not pulling the hair Referee there, knows that this is such an important match. He has to watch all aspects. John Finnegan is a great referee here in the ECW. He stays on top of the action. 
He knows what's going on inside that squared circle. I'm trying to really remember who wins this. Sully, let me ask you a question. Why is it called a squared circle? I don't know. I'm Steve, you don't know. I'm just so upset right now. I still can't get over all the Eddie Gilbert. Just despicable. Unbelievable. Well, maybe we'll try to get a... Uh... Uh, uh, update on Terry Funk later in the show. Would that make you happy, Jay Sully? Well, I, absolutely. We're going to have to send you probably back to the back to see how Terry Funk's doing. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Oh, Jimmy Snooker takes Tyro way off of his feet with that thumb to the throat. Oh! Horrible camera Incredible. work. Horrible Snuka. camera work. <laughs> well, just what we want to see a close up on Snooker's back. Got to keep him out of here, Stevie. I'm telling you, if he continues, I don't to interrupt understand him, what the point of that was. I'm head right out of here. It's not like he threw him over the top rope. He went to whip well, him in the ropes. And... Not Jay Sully, but I think Jimmy Snooker tried to throw that coffee that Eddie Gilbert had into the face of Tommy Cairo. Or excuse me, Cairo tried to throw it into the face of Jimmy Snooker. I don't think that's the way it happened. Call a spade Stevie. a spade, Jay Sully. Uh, the fans saw exactly what happened. Jimmy Snooker. Got Kyra up for a big pile driver. Oh, incredible. Oh, driver. that looked awesome. That looked awesome and devastating. Whoa. Kyra somehow makes the powers out. Two big right hands. But now, and I probably shouldn't even stop the match there, but that was this amazing, devastating pile driver. I, and, and like, Kyra's body literally. <laughs> it just uh, what's the what's the word I'm looking for? Like vaulted into the air, like a foot and a half off the ground, off his head. Looked amazing and devastating, and he gets up and he's fighting back. I mean, uh. oh, a flying elbow, incredible! Tommy Cairo fires back after that pile driver. I've never seen anything like it. Struggles to his feet. Look, it's still down. I mean, Cairo's Cairo making Eddie a Gilbert. mistake right here. Cairo should have paid attention to Snooker and Snooker only. Eddie Gilbert's got no reason here we to go. the ring. Oh, out of the way to get a taste of his own medicine. Jimmy Superfly Snooker. Looks That'll so bad. That'll teach Eddie Gilbert to stay away from ringside. A double noggin knocker there. Cairo hitting the heads of Snooker. Oh! Jimmy Snooker falling back. The referee's hurt on that one. referee's not getting up, Jay Sully. It's all, like, this sloppy. You know what I mean? Cairo. Did you notice Eddie was waving somebody in? Johnny Hotbody's in the ring. What's he doing? Cairo, a big right hand, takes care of Hotbody. Incredible. Johnny Hotbody out of the ring. What's Jimmy Snooker doing, Stevie? Jimmy Snooker is just watching the events that are transpiring right in front of his Cairo own face. Gets to it. Oh, Cairo throws Hotbody out of the ring, but Snooker... With a big right hand, knocks out Tommy Cairo. It appears to be at, oh, a oh, backbreaker. The famous the big flash. The big flash. You heard him, folks. There we go. Right here. It's climbing up. Tommy Cairo laid out prone in the middle of the mat. The super flies up for his patented move. Here we go. Oh, he hits it square. That should do it, folks. One, two, three. Three and Tommy Cairo no raises his hand. <laughs> Look at Eddie. I wonder how many times Snooker did that. I mean, it had to be thousands of times in a 30, 40 year career. I'm getting called to the ring by Eddie Gilbert. Hot stuff. Eddie Gilbert is calling for my broadcast colleague, Jay Sully. I wonder if, I mean, like the old Memphis stuff, can somebody tell me, was after every match, was these interviews that they're, that they're doing here? My entire life, there was no excuse for anything that you did with Terry Funk out here at the beginning of this match. No excuse getting involved in Jimmy Superfly's Snookus match. What do you have to say for yourself? First of all, <laughs> my name is Terry Funk. My name is not Eddie Gilbert, even though Eddie Gilbert just rattled my brain. He's one of the best wrestlers I've ever seen, and I want to go on record. Get me here, Jay Sully, stay right here. I want to go on record right now. Don't cover up my man. I want to yeah, go right. on record right now. Mr. Director. Right in front of the, I mean, camera. bad camera work. You moved back just a little bit. 
Of Eddie, see, Eddie Eddie knows because Eddie can see. Of what the ECW has in store. What they have to look forward to is a man who hasn't been around too much lately. A man who has been holding back just a little bit. A man who is waiting just for the right time, just for the right moment to reach out and to touch somebody. A man who now will become the next ECW television champion. And I'm talking about airborne superfly Jimmy Stuka. And all you doubters, all you disbelievers, you remember one thing. Terry Funk is gone. Terry Funk is like legends are supposed to be. Terry Funk is out grazing in the pasture somewhere. Terry Funk is gone from the ECW and what you people have to look forward to from here on out. It's Superfly, Jimmy Stuka, and Hot Stuff Eddie Gilbert, and most of all, Jay Sully, Hot Stuff International Reigns Supreme. And this is my TV show now, bud. Jimmy Snuka, newest member of Hot Stuff International, advances to the finals of the ECW TV tournament. All right, so we got Gilbert and Osborne coming up. So now, the real quick, the interesting thing is I bet you, you saw how Jay Sully kept getting in the way there. I bet you Gilbert chewed his ass out afterwards because he kept blocking Snook in a major, major mistake. So there you go. Another episode in the books. Thanks so much for tuning in. Remember, please go down below, hit the subscribe button and ring that bell. Get all the notifications. Also drop a comment, say hello, give me your input on the match. Give your input on me and um, give me a thumbs up. Thanks so much again for tuning in. Until the next one, uh, let's go to extreme.